What's going on YouTube? Geosno right here. So in today's video we're going to talk about the UFO VPN, which is a VPN that you can download for iOS, for Android, Windows and so on, which gives you more privacy on the internet and also unlocks more websites that normally are locked to you. You can find it in the App Store, it's VPN UFO VPN in here, and you can download it on your device. And it's actually a pretty good VPN in terms of free VPNs, but it's also a very good VPN on their paid plans. So the VPN itself is actually a very useful application. When you get a VPN, you ensure yourself another degree of security for your device. Normally, your internet provider would know everything about you, every website you visit and so on, and some websites may even refuse to work from specific countries. So if you want to see a website, for example, that only works in the US, you will not be able to do so if you don't have a VPN that simulates the US location. And UFO VPN has actually 2000 servers in 50 locations across the world, and you can select multiple countries in here with various degrees of ping and of course for various reasons for example if you select video and music it's going to give you a couple of services for example Netflix and Disney Plus which if you enable you will be able to watch Netflix and Disney Plus as if you are on Canada or in the US which is something very important if Netflix for example doesn't work for you in your country same thing for games if you open it in here you get multiple types of games and of course it gives you the location like Tokyo Singapore Toronto and so on you also have smart location which basically chooses one for you depending on the ping and depending on what you're going to use it and so on so this is actually a very good VPN in terms of that but one of the important things about this VPN is that it's a strict no logs VPN it does you no good if you get a VPN that actually logs everything you do so UFO VPN does have a strict no logs policy which is actually quite great because it means that they do not record what you do on the internet you are private they also have US and UK Netflix streaming and they also provide no data limit and no bandwidth limit which is great because there are many many other VPNs on the internet that would provide you a free service but it's so limited that it's actually completely useless and it also features bank grade AES 256 bit encryption for security so the data is virtually impossible to decrypt so if you want to use it once you get the application as you can see from here UFO VPN you get it from the App Store you press connect the first time and you're going to have to add a VPN profile to your network you press allow in here if you have a passcode it's going to ask you for it if you have touch ID you can use it and then it will attempt to connect and as you can see once it's connected you can see that I'm now connected in Germany and I'm on the VIP plan though there is a free version available and as you can see I'm now running on a VPN you can tell that your device is running on a VPN because of the VPN badge right there at the top right next to the Wi-Fi icon and of course at this point you are running on a VPN and as you can see websites still work it's pretty okay and you can see all the countries that this support so yeah you can get it for Mac OS you can get it for Windows you can get it for Android and you can get it for iOS so it actually picks the fastest server for you in my case I'm living in Italy and in this case the fastest server they have is in Germany which is actually good you can see here you have various degrees of ping now if you want to pick the smart location you, you press disconnect in here and it will connect to smart location which is basically one determined by the VPN application itself which in this case is Germany but you don't have to do that you can pick one yourself or if you want for example to watch Netflix you can select the Netflix in here for example I'm going to select the lowest ping which is Netflix Chicago and at this point as you can see it connects so once it connects you will be able to watch Netflix with no problem using this VPN now the settings in here for the SSX and the TCP HTTPS and so on you don't have to change unless you know what you're doing the auto setting is usually the best for you if you need support you press in here and it goes directly to the chat so you can ask a question right here and your question is asked as if you're in a conversation with them and of course you will get an answer once they pick up on your question you can even send them a photo so in terms of the support they do provide 24 7 customer support which is actually quite great now on the settings page in here you can even select the languages they do have a couple of them in here and you can also provide help to translate the application they do have Spanish for the moment Portuguese English Arabic Turkish and Chinese so that's good in terms of that and you can even do a speed test for example I'm going to use fast.com here now do keep in mind that my internet connection is usually pretty bad it's usually around uh, let's say 4.7 4.6 and right now it's 4.8 so it's still good it still works fine yes we do have pretty bad internet in Italy but trust me this is better than the connection I get with my ISP so this is actually good it doesn't drop the connection they also have an option here called Q 
kill switch. If you are a VPN user, I definitely would recommend you to use it. What the kill switch does is to automatically disconnect your internet on your device should the VPN actually get broken or disconnected or closed for some reason so that you don't leak any traffic without the VPN protection. Because if you open a website, for example, without being connected to a VPN, you automatically leak your IP address, your real IP address and your location. So if you enable in here the kill switch, if the VPN is not enabled, your internet connection would drop automatically to prevent leaking your IP address. This is actually a quite good feature. Here you can see all the protocols. The auto selects the most appropriate one, SSX for most users, fast speed, TCP for video calls like WhatsApp, Skype and so on, HTTPS for special occasions with stronger encryption, and of course HTTPSS which is double encryption, high level privacy protection. So yeah, overall this is actually a very simple to use application, you just select your country the way you want, for example I want United States, and you can see you can actually select a specific city from the United States with different degrees of ping, so I'm going to select for example New York, which is the closer one, and as you can see it connects in a couple of seconds, and you're protected at that point. You can also tell the VPN is connected because here on the settings now we have the VPN toggle and it's now toggled. So yeah, that's basically it. Check it out. UFO VPN, they do have a free version as well. Pretty trusted, a lot of users and of course quite fast servers in many many countries. Check it out in the link below.